Hey guys, how you going? Ozzy Stuntman here building some more Minecraft stuff for you. I've seen a couple of people making TNT cannons, or even TNT cannons, redstone cannons, obsidian cannons, I like to call it the big boom cannon, basically because they can go a long way. The furthest I did thought I could go, I built one right here, the first one I built, it was made out of stone and I found it was blowing up, so I made it out of obsidian, that's why it's half stone, half obsidian. And I could make it all the way down here, you can see all these cows and that are. Now I'm getting stuck, oh, get him, get him in this hole, let's go, get in there. No, go that way, that way, no, I'm not going to go there. Get in here, I thought it was doing long distance, and then it was stuck up along the wall here. I built this next cannon here, actually you can see some, one of the TNT did actually jump backwards. I'm not sure how that happened, it glitched because the TNT is really spastic and doing one of its own. Landed back here and blew this hole here, but this TNT has gone a long way and last one landed kind of like smack bang here and is a long way to go. And now I'm going to try my third cannon, we're going to try it and I'm going to show you guys how to build it. Chicken, you're going to die if you stay there. We'll fill it up, it's all ready to rock and roll. We'll just Get some of this redstone going around here. Put the TNT on. Leave one more gap. I'll tell you about the gaps in a second. It can be up to you how many you put in, how long you make it, and where you leave the gaps. Little magic button. Here we go. See how far we go. Sorry, chicken. That is pretty good for the first shot. You think it's not far because look how far I can go a lot further with it. You see, I've got the first one there. We'll try one more and then we'll I'll build it for you to show you how to do it. It's really simple when you look at it. You probably figure it out by yourself, but if not, very easy. Sorry. I thought I was going to sneeze then, did the whole weird voice thing. You know when you know like you know what it is like when you sneeze you're like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yes I just did that sorry here we go fill it right up leaving no spaces this time oops leave a little three one two three there we go make sure they're all exactly the same come back down to the little button let's push this and see this baby fly no. push the button and watch the baby fly here we go go further than before further than before come on you can do it oh there we go actually push two at that time Awesome, well there you go. Two went out this time, and actually see it blew the bottom out this time. Because the bottom is actually made out of dirt, because I just put it straight onto the ground. Anyway, I'm going to make one, show you how to do it, and if the bottom blows out, we'll tell you how to fix it. First of all, you want to come here and make a little circle. So you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's this little gap there, like at the end. And then you go down as many as you want. Normally go 13, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Do the same going back the other way. Then what you want to do is put one at the top here. That's a little, oops, that's where your TNT sits. TNT sits there. So you redstone on top. Just get a couple of torches and Nighttime cannon shooting is a lot better than daytime. So I will leave this at night time. Normally I take it to daytime for tutorials, but night time is where it's at now. So what we're gonna do is get your repeaters on this side just to slow this TNT down because you don't want to blow up the TNT at the same time. Otherwise, there's no use shooting it. It's like having a cannonball and a cannonball exploding in midair and then not absolutely doing anything towards it when I hit this target. So when you put these repeaters on, make sure they're all the same, otherwise it's just oops. There's no point putting them there. So what we do, and then you get your little half stone, half stone slab, whack it there. That's just basically to stop the water going at the end. Uh, sometimes I did leave the water out just to test it. I don't think it didn't make any, really any difference because I always make sure my water is not flowing, it is dead still. Fill it right up to the end here with the TNT. You can leave a gap or not leave a gap, that's just, like I said, up to you, but always leave the gap there, otherwise there'd be no water and you're in a whole lot of trouble. Get your button on the end here, and now you've got your redstone and make a little path around the outside. All the way down to the end to the last TNT, you have to hit the last TNT because it's going to get lit by that one there. Alright, there we go, it looks like this pig is going to be in a whole world of pain in a second. Here we go, let's test it out. Come on pig. Pig, chicken, cow, dessert, look. Oh, two at a time, that's actually good. 
See, it actually blew out the bottom, and now I can show you how to repair this thing. Now the cow's down there forever. Get obsidian, come all the way along here. Find, oop, find. fixed now, I might blow up a bit more at the end, but see, I am eventually obsidian the whole thing, because anything else, and it would be like, no, it will be destroyed, get out of the way cow, look at the water going on again, see it has, because it blown up the bottom, the TNT blew up everything, so basically you got to put it down again, so we'll be at the race down repeaters, so we'll just put on two, one, two, see the thunder thumb, so three, in four. So we're now we're on three, not four now. <coughs> Pardon me. Get some of this stuff going on. I think we're all ready to go. Little one up the top here for good luck. No, basically to get that one going. And here we go. Come down here, shoot it off again. Oh, missed it. Missed the button again. Third time's a charm. Here we go. See how we go this time. Come on. Oh. <laughs> Fail. That was a bit of a fail there, actually. Sorry. A bit of a hurry. If I forgot to fill the thing with TNT, you're like, Aussie oh, Stuntman, what are you doing? I wonder why this whole thing blew up. Why are you this to me? Why are you just to yourself? Why are you just to yourself? You're stupid! Nah. <laughs> yeah, don't judge me. Here we go. One, two. One, two. Four, four, TNT again. Pigs on a go boom. TNT in the water, make sure it doesn't actually explode, actually just pushes stuff, that's what they said. So it's really good for like, propelling things. Here we go, come on. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy shit. That did push that one a long way. So now we're going to try and make that ticks more because that made it go a long way. So what we'll do is now is... Set them to four. And see how we go this time. Oops, little thing in the front there. And hey presto, here we go, come on. Beat before, before was long, it was great. Oh, three of them went out that time, but there you go. Three that time, it's normally only meant to shoot one, but there you go. I got Obsidian Cannon, or the big boom, my big boom stick. Anyway guys, hope you enjoyed that, how to make Obsidian Cannon in Minecraft. A lot of exploding going on. See if you can get it further than that, try it. I think the furthest I've got it, like you can see, is this one here. I'm um, trying to get that farther than that and then send me a message and I'll check out your video anyway guys Thanks for watching this and I'll see you guys later Bye